this is Myra Elaine on the Buying in Space channel. Today I have the pleasure of having uh, lunch with Victoria and her mother Jacqueline and her husband Todd, uh, my adult child Marty, and my friend Kay Renee Guthrie, uh, who is also on YouTube. Of course, everyone knows Victoria Adventures in Reselling, and I go to her auctions. And she brought my merchandise with her today at lunch and at each and every single auction. Victoria places an invoice. She wraps your order up. She prepares her invoice. She prints it out and she puts it after she packages your order up. She puts the invoice for each auction uh, with your package. So that way there is no confusion. Some people that do multiple auctions, uh, well, let's just say they're not as organized as Victoria. She's very organized. And if you go to her channel, she uses forms for everything. So you'll need to fill out a form to uh, be able to bid so she can invoice you and send you your merchandise. Now, if you don't come to the meetups, you'll have to pay postage. But I go to the meetups. Now, there are nine of these in here. And these are premium shower capes. And these are wonderful if you are a caregiver. I have a mother with Parkinson's. And uh, her hairdresser comes by the house. So next time she comes by the house, she can use this uh, with mom and I also have some dry shampoo that I previously bought from Victoria that she can use Just uh, When she comes to the house, she expects us to have products for mom, which is understandable She's providing the service And here on this order we have C N D solar oil This must have been a day that I was busy, busy, busy. Because usually I buy more in an auction. Revitalift. Uh, I've recently had cataract surgery. I'm going to have another one. They prop your eye open. And it can cause um, like a, a droop below your eye. Because that eyelid below your eye, the, the uh, tissue below your eye is pulled back. So, uh, these are two sizes of this. And also, um, I've had parathyroid surgery, and I've got, uh, you know, I need to tighten up my skin and my neck as well. So, I buy products like this. This is for personal use. Um, I have some um, items I'm taking to church today to give to the Ukrainian orphans, or not orphans, just refugees. Um, there are a lot, unfortunately, there are a lot of orphans uh, in the refugees. And there's some, um, I should have brought it out here. Something I bought from Victoria previously for a children's earache and um, eye drops and cold formula. Just small bottles for children. Okay. Shipping. Zero. I love it. <laughs> I spent a lot of money today going out to European Street and eating. But you know what? I didn't spend as much as I would have spent on this postage. All these are a command damage-free hanging. Uh, I've combined households with my mother to care for her in uh, this. Um, is We haven't gotten our wall hanging straight exactly how we want yet. It's kind of a low priority, but tools like that help. And here's a brush. I think I got more than... I don't know. A lot of times when I go to auction and other people want things, even if I get the bid in first, I'll let them go ahead and take it. Yeah. There was a third. Somebody else got the third one. And here we go. We have some toothbrushes. We haven't changed out toothbrushes in this household 
since I moved in February. So we're hitting the six month mark with our toothbrushes. And you're really only supposed to go three months. So we're gonna be throwing away all the old toothbrushes and using these new ones. Here we have, this is a facial canvas. And cleaning. So these are facial uh, cleaning and uh, foundation. I'm not familiar with that product. I've never used it, but when you go to Victoria's Auctions, she gives such a good deal that you can uh, try new items. Like this is a brand new item for me. This is Chick. Uh, they were well, there are three of them here. This one's larger. And of course, we have Baby Dove. I'm going to give this to the Ukrainian refugees. I got it. A real inexpensive price. And I can't imagine having to leave your country... Oh, with an infant in tow. Oh, these are, oh, this is gorgeous. I have to pick out which color I like. This is Chick, I think. And this is Loyalty. Love the name. Oh, these smaller ones are, oh. Love this. This is nice and luxurious. Yeah, I got this for myself. I give away a lot of stuff. I use a lot of stuff for my mom. I use stuff for Marty, but actually, I don't know if Marty would want to wear lipsticks uh, since they're non binary. Um, definitely um, lip uh, gloss to keep your lips healthy, but I don't know about colors. They might like the colors, though, too, so I don't know. No, actually, this, I don't have to take a knife to. She packages so well. Okay, this is Dove Advanced Care. Uh, I pull off. I pulled the top off too hard. The, the sprayer fell on the floor. I'll get it later. And these I've ordered before. And I have some of these in boxes somewhere. And these are uh, cleansing spot and these tins. And they're wonderful. And I think I'll keep one and give two. Face saver, clear spot bandages. So these are little tiny dot bandages. So if you've got a little blemish here, a little blemish there. Um, if they weren't pink, these will be good for men to use for uh, shaving bandages. <laughs> but I don't know. You could, Men could still use them. I don't know if the bandages themselves... No, the bandages themselves are beige. So this could be used for uh, somebody starting to shave. <laughs> for your legs or your face, either one. It does call, the name of the product is Face Saver. So here we go. Oh yes, I'll order. You can see that my, um, I'm nail polish free right now. And my last, like 10 unboxing videos, my uh, fingernails were halfway painted. It was really sad. Okay, this is Honey Baby Milk and Honey Weave-In Conditioner. My hair has been frizzy, so that one's for me. Actually, these are for me, too. And uh, we have this color. We are in here in Jacksonville. We have a professional football team called the Jacksonville Jaguars, and their colors are uh, teal. Of course, this is more of a green. Um, and... Silver 
and black and white. And I didn't do this on purpose. This one's gold. I didn't order these on purpose as far as the Jacksonville Jaguars, but I just thought of that when I opened it up. Actually, these are kind of green instead of a teal, but the silver would work uh, if you were doing a uh, game day thing. And these are the uh, Baby Yoda. Oh, the Mandalorian antibacterial wipes. And these, uh, I'm gonna, well, I'm going to talk to Marty about these first. Marty might just go gaga over that. And it would be, uh, you know, a healthy building thing. Oops. Here we go. Vitalisting serum. What? Acne? Actually, there's no one in my household with acne. This must have been a really good deal. Sometimes I'll do that with Victoria because she'll put something up there. I don't know about that specific item. Let's just say it's a dollar. Now, this is like, she's like, oh, this is such an unusual hairbrush. And it is. And I don't know. It looks like. I don't know, it's hollow inside, so I don't know. I mean, it actually looks like some kind of attachment, but usually if you have an attachment for an item, you know, a, a blower, it's usually um, fits from this side. I don't know, it says quick blow dry. So you use it with a blow dryer. But, you know, you can use it without a blow dryer. But it does kind of look like it's an attachment because it has these slits in here that the air could come through. But you could use it as a regular hairbrush too. I'll have to research that one a little. And here we have hair color. This is like a touch up stick. I usually leave the sticker numbers on these products and don't take them off. I took a uh, soap pump out of the linen closet today and I got in the next auction, she offered these um, at a lower price and I jumped on them. I don't know if this is the first auction I ordered um, the nail polish or the second. Whoops. Here's another product in a tin. More bandages. These look like larger bandages. But there was one auction. She offered them. I ordered some. I left the rest in the next auction. I ordered more because she reduced the price. And she did it like a, I think these were the bundle that were of the ones that were rem remaining. And she offered them at a lower price. So I jumped on them. Now they're silver. Definitely gonna have to share some of this because I don't need silver. Two things of silver nail polish. Oh, and this was a highly unusual item. And I actually thought I might use this in another way, and I'm not remembering. Oh, we were laughing about uh, the sleeve on this because um, the instructions go on about um, stretching the rubber on this, but it's to protect uh, your cast if you have a broken arm. And here is some cute little bandages. Of course, I'll leave, keep one of these in our house. Bravely bandage. When you have a person hurt, sometimes you have to talk about how brave they are and how they are facing up to what's going on and uh, just, you know, give love and support when someone's injured. And this bandage company is very hip to that. And um, they've made bandages cute and they put them in this little tin and they even explain the layers of skin so you can heal. And the last product is another makeup item. 
It's from Maybelline, actually. And it's called uh, Vinyl Ink. I've got three of these. Uh, she put these up. She had all kinds of different colors. This was the first one she put up. And sometimes I'll do that. Um, kind of to get the party started with items and then she kept bringing them and bringing them let me see this one the sticker is over this to secure the lid so I'm gonna peel that back and we're gonna look at what these are like well oh it twists this off. Oh. Wow. I hadn't used anything on applicator like that. So that'll be new for me. But that is a nice product. And uh, I'll probably pass two of those along. Um, but I'm very satisfied when I go to Victoria's Auctions because she has such good prices and if something doesn't sell she wants to move it you know she will really she'll cut the price in half for you uh, here we go this is probably going to be Marty's hair color for Halloween <laughs> or I don't know we might be in the uh, pride parade in a week depending upon if uh, Marty can recover enough um, to do that so we'll see we're kind of looking holding our breath and looking forward to that and praying about Marty recovering uh, to the point where they can participate in that parade um, we, you know I just uh, have watched it every year for uh, you know since it's been going on here in Jacksonville I can't recall how many years we've had that parade uh, but and I've watched it on the internet and I've I've, of course support it but I can't um, always go to things because of my legs but our uh, preacher said that she was gonna have a truck uh, for some people that uh, weren't able to walk so maybe uh, Marty can do that and you know that would be great so I just uh, am looking at all of the wonderful things I want at Victoria's auction and uh going to figure out what to pass along and what to keep and what to use uh, for uh, my family. There's not really anything in here that, um, oh, I could probably send my sister-in-law some of this. There's not, not anything in here my brother could use, but I definitely could send some stuff for my sister-in-law, especially some of this makeup. <laughs> So, um, she, she could probably um, tell me more about it because I don't normally wear makeup. I've been um, gender non-conforming most of my life, and I just, uh, I would use makeup intermittently because I always thought that it was unfair that women had to use so much um, product when uh, men didn't to be socially acceptable and it's practically illegal at my age not to uh, use products <laughs> but I seem to do it and be okay um, but look at all this stuff I just can't believe it and um, you know I got these at prices that would have been you know I wouldn't have a fifth of this stuff if uh, it wasn't for Victoria she asked me today if I ever put mayonnaise in my hair because I brought that up. And I said, I don't have to resort to using a jar of mayonnaise. I get my personal care products from Victoria. <laughs> so um, I love this stuff, Victoria. Thank you so much. And you help my family a great deal, especially when I get products, you know, like the uh, shoulder capes, um, you know, and I purchased uh, some uh, silhouette disposable panties from you and uh, we're about to have a fight over that <laughs> there we're so needed 
<laughs> by several different members of my family of people I know. <laughs> so those ended up being highly popular. And I picked those up in Ocala. So you could, uh, on my last unboxing video from Victoria, I think I have those. So I only get to do an unboxing video for Victoria once a month, but Tuesdays and Thursdays at five o'clock, Victoria and Nanating have historically had an auction. Now, Victoria says she's quitting something on Tuesday at 2. So we'll find out if it's the auctions. But she's involved in so much, I'm praying that it's not the auctions because um, she provides so much personal care products for people in the community. She's filling a need. And um, I hope it's uh you know something else but it could be so we'll have to wait and see uh, what she's quitting i'll probably release this video tuesday before her two o'clock video and then um if there's a thumbnail for the five o'clock auction i'll put it on this video uh if there's not then i won't well if nana tinks posts one and Victoria does it because we don't know yet what Victoria is doing and I asked her at lunch and she wouldn't give me a hint <laughs> so um, I hope she continues I hope she doesn't quit uh, providing this service uh, to the community in her uh, personal care product auctions have a wonderful and blessed day everyone